In today's video, I'm going to show you how to convert your text to numbers here in Google Sheets. So I have some sample data right here, and I want to know if these values are actually in text format or in number format. One way we can figure out if that is in text or number format would be to use the isText function. So let's go ahead and start with the equal sign right here. Type in isText, select it right there, and select the value. You will already see a preview of the answer, which is true. And if we double click on this to fill in the rest of our data, it would give us the true value. So all of these values right here are not in number format, but in text format. Another way to confirm if those are text or numbers would be to try and get their total. So let's start the equal sign right here. Use the sum function to get that total. Select that range, press enter. And there you have it. The same way that if we were to try and get the sum of this range right here, which are in text format, press enter, it will give us the zero value. So how do we convert these text to numbers? We have three ways to do it. The first one would be to simply format this range right here. Go to format in the menu bar and select number. On the right side, you'll see that plain text is checked. If we go to number right here, there you have it. We have those decimal points as well. If you want to remove those, you can click on this one right here. Or you can go back to format, select number, and select automatic. And it will remove those decimal places. To confirm that these are now in a number format, again, we're going to do the sum function to get the total of that range. Select that range, press enter, and there you have it. So now we have converted those values into numbers. Let's try the second method. So another way to convert those texts into numbers would be to use the value function. Let's start off with the equal sign, type in value, or select it right here. And you'll see that this function converts a string into any date, time, or number format. So let's go ahead and select that cell reference, press enter, and there you have it. If we double click on this, now we have converted those texts into numbers. To confirm that, we're going to try and get the total again with the sum function. Select that range, press enter, and there you have it. If we were also going to use the isText function, we'll see if it's still going to give us the true or the false value. So if we select this one, it will now tell us that this is false. And there you have it. And the final way to convert this value or this text into a number would be to use any mathematical operator into your formula. So let's start with the equal sign. Click on this cell reference right here. Add a zero to it and press enter. And now it will give you a number. So if we drag that formula right here and get the sum of this range. Click on that. Press enter it will give you this total. Another confirmation again that you can do is to do is text, select that value, and now it will give you a false. And there you have it. Those were three easy ways on how you can convert your text to numbers and some easy tips to confirm as well if your values are in text format or in number format. Thank you for watching this quick tutorial. Make sure to subscribe for more helpful videos and I will see you in the next one.